just thought I'd show you uh, a finished mod of some Dark Elder units. These are my heavies, the Scourges. And what they got is basically Scourges is the Dark Elder's version of Fast Attack. Several other classified as heavies. And they have wings instead of jump packs. And here are my scourges with their finished wings. They're not uh, finished being painted yet, but uh, that is them so far. Now the one in the middle here is the original Scourge. I don't really have good lighting set up here yet, but there's a picture of the original Scourge. I don't know if he's coming in good or not on my screen. He's a little unfocused. The wings are really shiny at the moment because of the black paint that I'm using. I've decided to change the paint for some of the stuff I'm painting. I have been using the Apple Barrel product, but uh, right now I'm using I'm gonna be using a mix of both. The black that I got on there is Createx Opaque Black and I really like it. Uh, one, it plies on really thin. The wings did take two coats, but even with two coats it was still super thin and the paint dried really fast. Scourges themselves, they're not really that uh, cheap for a unit. Uh, they do take the heavy slot, like I said before. There are 80 points for five of them, and then to have them upgraded with splinter cannons, you can have four per unit, is another 80 points. You can have dark glances as an upgrade, but since they don't have relentless, they're pretty much pointless because their whole feature is being able to move a total of 12 inches and it can also deep strike but if you deep strike you can't shoot dark glances because you're considered to have moved six inches so yeah splintering cannons are really the only upgrade you can go a group of five for the 80 points with wings and no weapon upgrade but what's the point they're heavy units. You want firepower or or maximum strength damage. So I can't really say much more. I think I'm gonna go once I get a couple. Of, I need to put a second coat on some of these other wings here. But once I get the second coat, then I might go over with a little bit of a, a little bit of a deep red and brown highlights on the wings. See if I can give them a little bit more textured. So here are some guys that I tried to put a wash on. And I, so I put a wash. What I did is I held the guy the the troop upside down when I did the wash. Same thing here with the warp base. And maybe I just wasn't clipped quick enough with applying the wash. I know I was kind of slow applying the wash on the warp beast here, but like on a troop I thought I did it pretty fast. But I didn't like it. It just it really made the unit darker than what I'd want as far and you know, so then I go back over with a highlight. So I did try to dry brush some of it. There's still some of the wash there but no, no. I'll have to 
take some shots. But, I mean, like, here's a warp piece with the wash. So, like, there, I have to highlight the warp piece yet. But, I mean, here's the base coat that I used. I mean, that's the base red. And that's with the wash on it. And I'm using Citadel's wash. That's the Citadel wash I'm using is a Sherman blue. So, I don't know, I'll, I'll put some highlights on the cat later and see if it works out. I did put some highlights on the Dark Elder with the wash. I accidentally was using the wrong blue for the highlight. I was using a light blue. My bright blue versus the uh, cobalt blue. Base coat is cobalt blue. I put the wash on it. And I intended to go back over it with the cobalt blue, but I accidentally started with some light blue. But I didn't put too much of the light blue on there that damaged it. So then I went and dry brushed the cobalt blue. Oh well. Let me know what you think. You definitely can see that there is more shading with this unit with the uh, with the wash compared to this one here. The light's just bouncing off in it, so maybe it's a good thing. I, I just just really can't tell. Of course, this one doesn't have a full. Well, he's got some good blue on him, but the cat just did not turn out right. I mean, it's like, I thought the wash was supposed to go in the cracks of the model, but it seems like it all applied on the outside, not even getting into the cracks. So, yeah, I don't know about the washes. Not entirely sold on it yet. I didn't want to go with a black wash, uh, just because I think, I, re I mean, I read in one magazine, art magazine, where the, an artist says that he likes to use blue because it tends to be more natural. And I agreed with that idea. I'll throw some still pictures in with this and uh, call it a night. Thanks for watching.